hello viewers this is prince Bear tv welcome back to my channel today um i would like to show you a video i want you to watch this video and listen attentively because since you're in this video is going to really make a whole lot of sense and you're going to learn from it so stay tuned while i put the video for you to watch take it or leave it we are all collectively responsible for the good or bad that our society becomes the carry in you Abba Kiari today is the new song for trading or tampering with drugs, exhibit, if you like, recovered from a suspect. It was alleged also that Evans the kidnapper complained then that the team of policemen led by the same Abba Kiari that arrested him ransacked his house and went away with some cash which never got to the station. No be today, police they make arrest and the exhibit no go reach station. If you remember, the Wonder Bank owner then, Umana Umana, more than half of the money recovered from his house. Now, only a fraction reached police station as exhibit. The list is endless. Thanks to the neglect, inefficiency, or if you like, ineptitude, that our government, encouraged by all of us, has turned police and our various public institutions into. The custom guy at the port, constantly harassing potters for bribe in cash, even after paying the required duties. No be carry be that. Immigration will collect money to facilitate your passport issuance process despite paying the required statutory fee. At the end, passport booklet no day, and you think it's only in the police that you have about carry. The NDLA guy collects money from drug dealers to help escort their drugs. Why the civil defense man employed to protect pipeline is the one holding the light for the man vandalizing the pipeline and protecting the people illegally refining crude. And you think it's only a bakiari. It is plenty. People imported bad premium motor spirit fuel into the country and same passed through ports, clearance, and validation, destroyed people's cars without compensation. Yet no heads will roll. And you say the full NMPC, no be a bakiari. They deceive yourself. The service chiefs allegedly buries money meant to buy arms in septic tank behind his house. Why his men are dying in battle for lack of arms and ammunition? Tell me, between him and Abba Kiari, who was pass? A lawyer collects money from a client to file a frivolous matter just to delay the course of justice, even when he knows the truth. How is that different from, from the Kiari's case? A governor consistently creating security to justify his collection of security vote is actually what breeds the Kiari syndrome, free cash. A politician and his cronies amongst us over invoice contracts some, and in some cases, we either still do a shoddy job or not execute the job at all after collecting full contract money. And today, that same politician will be blaming Abba Kiari. A lecturer sleeps with female students and collects money from the male students in exchange for Mark and still goes on strike over non-payment of salaries. We'll be shamelessly pointing accusing fingers at Abba Kiari today. A civil or public servant who is collecting kickback for doing the job he's paid to do is not different from Abba Kiari. Make I tell you if you don't know now. Our religious leaders, they say God to their followers while collecting tithe, offering first fruits and all in the midst of hunger for their personal benefit. Tell me if that one no worse pass Kiari. Remove the log in your eyes. You are a youth suffering the ineptitude and misgovernance of our politicians and yet... Still collect peanuts to help them rig election. Now, now, they carry this country so. How about the relatives who collect his uh, deceased brother's uh, property, hiding under some repugnant customs while leaving the widow and children to suffer? Definitely, that is worse than selling drugs. Your Peking know they work and know they do business, but comes home with expensive gift items and even feeds you and, and the entire family, buys you gifts. Are you not encouraging and nurturing the carry in him or her? The list is endless. Just add your own and you'll be spot on. We all join hand destroy this country. I will therefore advocate that until we collectively decide to remove the greed inherent in us and decide to imbibe good over evil, deceit, fraud, cheat, lies, and propaganda, irrespective of our position, political affiliation, tongue, and tribe, we can blame Abba Ab carry today and by tomorrow, the next day, the system will throw another carry in our faces as it is inherent in all of us. After all, now who they catch today be thief. 
Well, that's our package for today. Keep the advocacy going by simply following us on all our social media platforms showing on your screen. Let's remove the carry in our life before blaming Abba carry because we all contributed to the mess called Nigeria. See you next week.